everyone, Ryan Young, Kama Jiu Jitsu. It's a beautiful day out, so I decided I'd sit outside and just thought to myself, you know what? I just had a conversation with Dave Kama, Professor Dave Kama. Uh, in case you don't know, Dave Kama is one of the dirty dozen in Gracie Jiu Jitsu. He is maybe number six, and he and Chris Saunders were the first two to get their black belts from Master Hicks and Gracie, the master of masters. And Dave is probably Hickson's best black belt that he's ever that he's ever taught. And in fact, uh, he would take Professor Dave with him all over the world to help him conduct seminars. Hickson would do these massive seminars, and he obviously would need help. So he would, on his own dime, take Dave with him to help him. And and this this doesn't change. In fact, two weeks ago there was a huge seminar out in Albany, New York, and there were about 300 people that attended, and, and, and once again, he had Dave Kama come out and help him with that seminar. Now, this one was different, though, because uh, as Hickson's uh, gotten into retirement, he's made his mission spreading Gracie Jiu-Jitsu and, and traditional Gracie Jiu-Jitsu with that. He's fully acknowledging that we do have a sport version of jiu-jitsu that's flourishing thanks to uh, competition. However, what he's finding is that his family's jiu-jitsu and the self-defense principles behind it are starting to become diluted. And I'm lucky because I spent a lot of years with Dave Kama and also with Hickson uh, prior to that in the 90s where my my formative years in jiu-jitsu have been, have been pretty well formed. I think my foundation's really good, and I think my, my philosophies are, are those of Professor Dave's and Master Hickson's. Now, it's not the same for a lot of people. Today, if you want to train in Gracie Jiu-Jitsu, there is very little chance that you will get taught by one of Elio's sons, as, as we were able to be taught back in the late, late 80s. Oh, it's been that long. Now, and... With the proliferation of competition and, and the rules that go with it, jiu-jitsu has changed pretty significantly. So Master Hickson, seeing this over the last 20 years or so, has now made his mission to spread his brand of jiu-jitsu. And that's where the formation of the Jiu-Jitsu Global Federation, also known as the JJGF, uh, that, that's where that comes from. And obviously, uh, being a Dave Kama school, uh, we are... JJGF black belts as well. So, here's the mandate. Hickson gives to Dave, tells him he is now working his best to spread his jiu-jitsu all over the world. And he wants Dave to do the same thing. So, being that Dave is my professor, and Dave will be here next week uh, to, to kind of discuss this, I thought I'd just kind of throw this out to you and let you know that's, that's in our plans. We want to do what we can to spread Hicks and Gracie's Jiu-Jitsu all over the world, and at least do our part to do it. So if it's not through one of our academies here, you know, we've got four academies now with the, with the brand new opening of uh, Trophy Club Texas later this month. And in addition to the other uh, Flower Mound, Texas, we have as well as two in Orange County, California, we've got Laguna Niguel and Irvine. Um, we want to do what we can to spread outside of our academies. So it's great that we have our academies and we can spread jujitsu there, but we fully acknowledge that there are a ton of you that are training in outside academies, and we'd like to be able to spread it to you as well. One of the easiest ways to do it is through the obvious channels of a seminar. But if that doesn't work for you, then how about you have us come over and teach a class? So what we'll do is we'll teach a class the exact same way we teach a class in one of our academies. We'll run through uh, some of the self-defense. We'll run through some of the conditioning exercises as well as the um, And we're also going to Hickson's Groundwork. And the easiest way for us to get that done is for you to simply get a hold of us. And let, let's make this happen. The easiest way to get a hold of us, a uh, number of ways actually, a lot of them. Uh, so the first one is you could email us at kamajujitsu at gmail.com. That is K-A-M-A jujitsu at gmail.com. You can also reach us via Facebook. We have three Facebook pages. We have Kama Jiu-Jitsu on Facebook. We have Kama Jiu-Jitsu Dallas-Fort Worth on Facebook. 
and we have BJJ Professor on Facebook as well. The last is you can call me direct. My direct number is 682-233-0721. Once again, it's 682-233-0721. That's, uh, that's my direct cell phone number. So you can call me. If you don't reach me, you can leave a voicemail, or you can even text me. And, and let's get this working. So what are, we, what are we doing again? Hickson's mandate, spread his jiu-jitsu all over the world. And we, as a Hickson Gracie Team Member Academy, we are going to do our, to do our best. Um, to do it and we need your help so get in contact with us let us know how we can get this going in your area have a great rest of your day happy training tonight take care bye bye